Jesus Calls International. This ministry brings hope and comfort to millions of people, resulting in thousands finding the Lord Jesus as the Savior of their lives. Your sorrow will turn into joy. The Lord chose Dr. Paul Denikrin, co-founder of the Jesus Calls Ministries when he was in the days of his youth. His public meetings attract 200,000 to 500,000 in a single service. We are here to pray for you and pray with you. Dr. Paul has established Jesus Calls prayer towers all over the world through which people find divine comfort and peace. Keep the faith because God wants to do something awesome for you today. Dr. Paul is Chancellor of Corunya University. Corunya University to research finding products to solve the problems of humanity. Dr. Paul also runs an organization called Sisha, which is the social service wing of Jesus Calls Ministry. It's a outreach to care for poor young people. The women, the destitutes, come, let's give life. Together, we are here to pray in one accord that this blessing of the best of God shall come upon you. Your breakthrough is on the way. Just keep believing and pray with us. This is Jesus Calls International. My precious friend, we are here in Jesus Calls to pray for you. The Lord has called us to pray for the broken-hearted people. Yes, that's why we have our prayer tower. In the prayer tower, we have people answering calls and 24 hours, our prayer intercessors are available to take your calls, to take your prayer requests, to pray with you, and also pass on your prayer request to me to pray along with them and send an answer to you. So please feel free to call our prayer tower. The number is on the screen. Or also, you can go to our website, jesuscalls.com, and leave your prayer request there it'll come to me and we will pray and write back to you and also my friend we have a very special prayer meeting every Friday night in our Dallas Texas prayer tower it's on I-35 and Regal Row exit and we pray for everyone who comes there we anoint the sick with oil and we have been seeing mighty miracles happening there so please come every Friday night at the Dallas prayer tower. Yes, my friend, you can get the direction by calling the number that's on the screen or also go to our website and we'll be there to receive you. My precious friend, God has a very special blessing for you. You must remember God has called you to righteousness. God wants you to be holy. God wants you to be sanctified. God wants you to have a great name. That's the name of being God's child. Yes, you are called for that. God loves you. He has a great future for you. Future of being God's child. Yes, my friend, your life will be full of glory and full of peace. Every blessing will come to you. You will not struggle for it, but He will lead you to work, lead you to do things, lead you to say things, lead you to think in your heart according to His plan. And as you do it, as you think it, as you speak it, God's power will come upon you to fulfill all that He has planned for you. And miracles will happen. You'll have a glorious future. This is God's plan for you. Do not be afraid. We're going to pray that this grace will come upon you today. Expect great things from God. Our precious friends, we thank God for the opportunity to bring His love to millions of people through this program and to pray for you through this program. Millions of broken hearts are healed. We have 100 programs every week in 12 languages going to nearly 190 countries. Praise God for all these mm. networks which carry the mm. prayer time program of Jesus Calls. Mm. Millions are blessed. Only when we get to heaven we will know mm. how many have been blessed. My friend, we want to give you an opportunity to take this love of God to millions around the world through this program. Mm. We want to have you honored 
in this program and we want to pray for you by mentioning your name in this program. So as you give a thousand dollars for a program, you can send in your name on your birthday or on your anniversary or on the birthday or anniversary of your loved ones and my wife and I will mention your name, mention the name of your loved one and pray over television for God to bless you and your family. Your thousand dollar gift can bring blessings to millions and you too can be blessed. We want to be a blessing to you. It's called the TV Sponsorship Plan. You can go to our website, jesuscalls.com and you can register yourself as a family or yourself and be a partner as a TV sponsor to bring blessings to millions of people through your thousand dollar gift. Would you please call the number that is on the screen and somebody will help you to become this partner or go to our website and may God bless you abundantly and give you grace to make this happen. The Holy Spirit is here. El, el Espíritu Santo está acá. Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Donde el Espíritu de Dios está, ahí hay libertad. Tonight the Lord told me that He's filling everyone with His mighty Holy Spirit. Esta noche el Señor me dijo que iba a llenar con medio del Espíritu Santo a todas las personas que están Every family with His mighty Holy Spirit. A todas las familias que están acá. When God's Holy Spirit comes, cuando Dios y el Espíritu Santo llega, Jesus said in John 14 verses 16 to 18. Juan 14, 16 al 18 dice he will always abide with us. que Él siempre estará con nosotros he will always abide with us. que Él estará con nosotros he says, I will not leave you comfortless, my children. Él dijo que nunca lo dejaré I'll be with you. estaré con ustedes not only in this ground, no solo en esta tierra shall you experience Jesus. tienes que experimentar a Dios Jesus wants to come with you. Él quiere estar contigo he wants to live with you. Él quiere vivir contigo, quiere ser tu consolador. He wants to do everything for your life. Él quiere hacer todo para ti, para tu so vida. So you're going to carry Jesus with you tonight. Nosotros vamos a estar con Jesús ahora. Vamos a encontrarnos con él. And how do you carry Jesus? Y cómo encuentras a Jesús? It is through the Holy Spirit. Es por medio del Espíritu Santo. When God's Holy Spirit comes into you. Cuando Dios por medio del Espíritu Santo viene a ti. Jesus comes into you. Jesús viene a ti. The Lord is that Spirit. Suelta su Espíritu. And where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Y cuando es donde hay está el Espíritu Santo ahí hay libertad the Bible says in John 14 and verse 20, la Biblia dice en Juan 14 20 Jesus says, Jesús dijo en ese día en ese día you will know that I am in you and you are in me conocerás que yo estoy en ti and I am in the Father y en mi Padre tonight you're going to have God coming into you esta noche trae, Dios estará con nosotros how many of you desire that God should come into you cuantos de ustedes quieren que Dios venga a ustedes tell him Lord I desire you coming into me dile Dios yo quiero que vengas a mí and as you desire that, y cuando deseas eso, God will come into you in the form of a spirit. Él vendrá a ti por medio de su espíritu. He is God's spirit. Porque él es espíritu. When the spirit of God comes into you, porque cuando el espíritu de Dios viene sobre ti, literally tí, feel Jesus is with you all the time. Sentirás a Jesús también en ti. From today you will not feel lonely. De aquí en adelante ya no te sentirás solo. You will feel God is with you always. Tú sentirás que Dios siempre está contigo en todo momento. As God fills you with the Holy Spirit. Porque el Señor te llenará con el Espíritu Santo. Let not your heart be troubled. Que tu corazón no te agobie. Jesus said, Jesús dijo, "My children, mi hijos, I will not leave you comfortless. Yo no te voy a dejar sin consolarte. I will not leave you as an orphan. Yo no te dejaré como un órfano. I will not leave you lonely to fight your life's battles by yourself. No te dejaré solo para que pelees las peleas solo. I'll come to you. Yo vendré a ti. I'll come to you. Vendré a ti. Tonight he's coming. Esta noche él está llegando. All acá. that you have to do is to ask. Him. Todo lo que tienes que hacer. God will fill you with His Holy Spirit. Es dejar lo que entre y Dios te llenará por medio del Espíritu Santo. Jesus will come to you. Y Jesús vendrá a ti. When the Holy Spirit comes, cuando el Espíritu Santo llega, what does he do? ¿Qué él hace? If you read Isaiah 28 and verse 11, si lees Isaías 28:11, 
He makes you speak in new tongues. Él te hace hablar en diferentes lenguas. Mark 16 and verse 17 also says that. Marcos 16, 17 dice you will begin to speak with new tongues. Comenzarás a hablar en diferentes idiomas you will speak new things. Comenzarás a ver nuevas cosas you will say, Am I speaking this? Y te preguntarás ¿Estoy hablando este idioma? Look at Zacchaeus. Miren a Zacchaeus In Luke chapter 19 and verse 8. En Lucas 19, 8 You find that he is a sinner. Que te das cuenta que él era un pecador. Everybody called him sinner. Que le llamaban pecador. He was taking bribes. Él sobornaba. He was destroying the families. Sobornaba las familias. And everybody hated him because he was treating people unjustly. Y todo el mundo lo odiaba porque él era un sobornador. Maybe he was a big rowdy in the town. De pronto él era alguien que nadie le parecía bien. Stealing people's money. Robaba el dinero de las personas. But this man had a longing to see Jesus. Este hombre tenía un deseo por ver a Jesús. He was short, él era bajito. So he got on a tree, se subió en un árbol. And he was hiding himself. Y estaba escondiéndose. He just looked to see how Jesus was. Y miró a ver cómo se miraba Jesús. There was a big crowd. Había mucha gente alrededor de él. Jesus was lost in the crowd. Y Jesús a puras penas se miraba alrededor. But he was on the tree. Y él estaba alrededor del árbol. Trying to look at Jesus just to see who he was. Andaba buscando a Jesús para ver cómo se miraba. How he looked. Estaba dándole un vistazo. Maybe you have come like that. De pronto venimos también a este lugar. Just to see what is happening. Dándote un vistazo a ver qué está pasando alrededor de acá. But Jesus came. Pero Jesús vino. And stood right under the tree. Y vio a Zacarías ahí mismo en el árbol. Nobody knew that Zacarías was there. Nadie sabía, solo él sabía. But by the power of God, Jesus knew. Pero por el poder de Dios, Jesús sabía que él estaba en el árbol. Jesus knows you are here. Y Jesús sabe que tú estás acá. That's why he calls the names of the people. Y es por eso que él llama los nombres de las personas. Just a few names. Él hace varios nombres. Just to prove that he knows every one of you. Solo para probar de que él conoce los nombres de cada persona. If he wants, he can call everybody's name. Si él quisiera, él pudiese llamar a cada uno de los nombres. It'll take months together. Porque él los conoce todos. But just as a sample, he calls a few names. Pero solo para probar que él es Dios, solo dice algunos nombres. It's not that they are the only blessed ones. Y no es que solo ellos sean los bendecidos. Jesus loves everybody. Porque Jesús ama a todos. In that big crowd. Pero donde hay mucha gente. He stood under the tree. Él mira al árbol. And called that man by his name Zacchaeus. Y él llama a ese nombre por su nombre Zacchaeus. Jesus never met him before. Y Jesús nunca lo había conocido. And he said, Zacchaeus, I know you. Y le dice Zacchaeus, yo te conozco. I know everybody. Yo conozco a todos. Zacchaeus. Pero Zacchaeus. Come down. Ven abajo. I want to come to your home. Yo quiero ir a tu casa. Tonight Jesus says I want to come to your home. Y esta noche Jesús te está diciendo quiero ir a tu casa. That's why we prayed for God to bless our families. Yo quiero que tú que Dios bendiga toda tu familia. He came down quickly. Ven rápido. Zacchaeus was taking Jesus home. Y Zacchaeus se llevó a Jesús a su casa. Everybody was saying he's a sinner. Y todo el mundo le decía Jesús él es un pecador. How can Jesus go to the home of a sinner? ¿Cómo es que Jesús puede ir al hogar de un pecador? Does everyone say you are a sinner? Todo el mundo le decía Jesús dice que tú eres un pecador. Have everybody cast you out? Y nadie le gusta. Jesus is coming only to your home. Y Jesús viene también a tu casa. He will come only to your home first. Y él vendrá también a tu casa primero. You are going to take Jesus home first more than anybody else. Tú llevarás a Jesús a tu casa más que cualquier otra persona. Are you happy? Estás feliz. Shout a big hallelujah if you are happy. Grita aleluya. Jesus is coming to your home. Jesús está llegando a tu casa. You may say you're a sinner. Probablemente tú digas yo soy un But pecador. But Jesus, he loves you more than anybody else. Pero Jesús te ama más que cualquier otra persona. He loves the sinners who seek him more than anybody else. Él ama a los pecadores que lo buscan de corazón más que cualquier otra persona. And when Zacchaeus was taking Jesus, y cuando Zacchaeus llevó a Jesús a su casa, the Bible says Zacchaeus stood. La Biblia dice que lo miraba. And he turned to Jesus. Y lo miró Jesús. And he told. Y le dice. He spoke in new tongues. Y cuando él habló comenzó a hablar en diferentes idiomas. He said, Jesus. Y le dijo Jesús. I will give away half my wealth to the poor. Y le dice yo voy a dar mitad de todos mis bienes a los And pobres. And I will give back four times what I have taken unjustly from the people. Y voy a darle cuatro veces más lo que injustamente le han quitado a las personas. Until then. Hasta ese momento. Zacchaeus was only telling everyone give your money give your money give your money él le decía a las personas da tu dinero da tu dinero da tu dinero 
primero. But now, Pero en este momento, when Jesus came, cuando Jesús llegó, he spoke in new tongues, él habló nuevos idiomas, new language, nuevas lenguas, because he got into a new life. Porque él comenzó una nueva vida. He said, "Now, Jesus, y le dice ahora Jesús, you have come into me. Ha llegado a mí. I can't speak the old language. No puedo hablar ningún otro I idioma. I can't live the old life. No puedo vivir la vida vieja. Get afterwards, I'm going to give. Yo estoy dispuesto a dar todo. Give to the poor. Estarle dando a los in pobres. In your name, Jesus. En tu nombre, Jesús. I'm not going to take money unjustly. Yo no voy a tomar el dinero injustamente. I'll not take bribes. No voy a sobornar a la gente. I will give four times back what I have taken. Voy a darle cuatro veces más a los pobres He's y los que quitado. New tongues. Y él habló en nuevas lenguas. Yes, my friend. Mis amigos. When the Holy Spirit comes upon us. Cuando el Espíritu Santo llega a nosotros. God's righteousness will come. La santidad de Dios llega. Yes, you will become a righteous man. Y tú te convertirás en una persona santa. You'll become a righteous woman. Una mujer santa. Today you may be a sinner. Y de pronto esta noche tú eres un pecador. But when God's spirit comes into you tonight. Pero cuando Dios llega a tu corazón esta you noche. You will speak in new language. Hablarás en nuevos idiomas. New tongues. En nuevas lenguas. Your life lenguas, will be righteous. Y tu vida será santa. You will say, Am I living a righteous life? Pregúntate, ¿estás viviendo una vida santa? Now I am clean in my relationship with my wife. Estoy teniendo una relación limpia con la relación de mi esposa. Now I am clean in my relationship in my family. ¿Cómo es mi relación con mi familia? Now I don't take any evil things. Ya no creo en cosas vanas. I don't take money unjustly. Yo no tomo dinero injustamente. I am righteous. Yo soy una persona santa. You will have a new life. Tengo una vida nueva. Tonight it's coming to you. Esta noche llega a ti. The whole world will look at you. El Señor te está viendo. And say you are righteous. Y te dice tú eres santo. You are righteous. Tú eres justo. They will love you. Te amo. Your relatives will honor you. Tú perteneces a mí. The people in your working place will honor you. Y las personas en tu trabajo te honrarán. The nation will honor you. El Señor te pondrá en lugares buenos. You will have peace with all men. No hay nada que tengas que esconder. No will power can give you that clean life. No hay un poder humano que te pueda dar eso. Only Jesus. Solo Jesús. Only Only Jesus. Solo Jesús. Because he shed his blood on the cross. Porque él derramó su sangre en la cruz. And the blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all sins. La sangre de Jesús nos limpia de todo pecado. The sacrifice of the Holy One, Jesus Christ. El sacrificio del Santo Jesucristo. Sacrifice of shedding his blood to cleanse us. El sacrificio de derramar su sangre es el que nos limpia. Has made a way for us to be clean. Ha hecho un camino para que nosotros podamos estar limpios. Tonight that Jesus is ready to come into your life. Esta noche Jesús está listo para llegar a tu casa. Cleanse you. Limpiarte. And always to be with you. Y para siempre estar contigo. Not only he will cleanse you tonight. Él no solo te va a limpiar. Not only your addictions will leave you. También las adicciones se irán. But always he'll keep you clean. Pero siempre te mantendrá limpio. That's why he fills you with the Holy Spirit. Y te limpiará y te llenará por medio del Espíritu Santo. My friend, I'm here to pray with you right now. Shall we pray? Father, let your peace that passes all understanding come into thy son, come into thy daughter. Lord, please sanctify them. Please sanctify them. Please remove all the addictions, Lord. Right now, right now, right now. Every smoking, every drinking, every drug, every wrong relationship, every addiction of cheating people, every addiction to seeing wrong things and enjoying the lust and the pleasure. Lord, let it leave right now in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Lord, you have created everyone's body to be holy, to be your temple. Give thy son, thy daughter who is watching this prayer, the grace to become the temple of the Holy Spirit, the temple of God, to have his or her body filled with God himself, Lord. The Lord Jesus himself, the Holy Spirit himself. Lord, please, as they cry for help, as they cry for mercy, as they cry for strength, enter into their heart right now, Lord Jesus. Let every sin leave, every addiction leave, every wrong relationship leave, every weakness in the spirit leave in Jesus' name. Father, please, 
rescue them by your power and master please give them a new heart a new spirit right now open their eyes to see you let them feel they have never sinned any more and give them the strength never to do the things that they have done which has brought destruction to their spirit and soul please release them by your power please release them by your power please release them lord by your power prove that you care for them the blood of jesus christ cleanses us from all sins cleanse them with your blood lord and transform them by your power in the name of jesus in the name of jesus father give them a new heart to read thy scriptures and to pray unto you daily now let the peace of god fill their heart let them feel that jesus has cleansed them and you have come into their hearts my friend god has filled you right now so keep on praising him praising him praising him praising him and now i command every arthritis to be healed peter peter jesus touched you right now your arthritis is being healed by the power of god every one suffering with arthritis be healed in jesus name every pneumonia be healed in jesus name every problem in the lungs be healed be healed be healed right now in jesus name father remove that agony remove that agony and set them free let them be free lord let them be free lord let them be free as somebody suffering with gangrene god touched you anthony god touched you right now tony rise up and be healed rise up and be healed rise up receive the new organs by the power of god lord let the gangrene dry up let them have life let them live lord please take care of them please take care of them please take care of them anxiety is troubling many heart arthritis is troubling many bodies let the arthritis be healed right now right now in jesus name in jesus name allergies be healed in jesus name by the power of god father remove every guilt remove every fear remove every torture every hurt in jesus name by the power of god thank you for releasing them right now right now right now right now right now master if there's anyone unemployed who is watching this program please do a miracle and provide a beautiful job for them by your power by your power let them be given a job in jesus name by jesus by jesus let them excel in their jobs and rise up in their jobs get promotion in their jobs let grants come for their research let sponsorships be given for their studies in the name of jesus do this miracle lord create these jobs for them create the salaries for them do miracles and prosper them lord let them understand everything and have your divine peace on all sides let peace prevail peace prevail peace prevail everyone who is praying for their children lord if the children are giving them a hard time the kids let them be healed let their spirits be healed let the kids receive a new heart let love flow into their hearts for their parents for their brothers and sisters let there be peace and let them come home let there be joy and oneness in the family by the power of god thank you for doing it lord thank you for answering everyone's prayers concerning this matter and giving them a peaceful future we give you all the glory all the glory all the glory bless them this day in every way answer their prayers whatever they have prayed and give them a glorious future by your power in jesus name amen my friend jesus loves you he cares for you his peace shall reign in your heart jesus calls international has a deep burden for the broken hearted and is always praying for god's wonderful works and bringing smiles back to all people If you've received the touch of God through this program, let us know so that we can glorify God together. Please write your prayer request to Dr. Paul Denikran and his family, and they will pray for you. You can also look forward to a reply from the Denikrans as they personally respond to your mail or email. Email your prayer needs to prayers at jesuscalls.com. 
If you'd like to partner with us in this great commission, please support us through your prayers and contributions every month. What the Lord has in store for the nations of the world. You will see it begin to be accomplished from 2015. The children shall fight the unrighteousness. Many will turn to me from this year, says the Lord. The women will fight against the corruption and they will break its power at the roots. Enjoy God's establishment of peace in your life. This spirit-filled DVD from Dr. Paul will be your gift for your love offering of $25 or more to Jesus Calls International. Send your contributions to Jesus Calls International, 8855 North Stemmons Freeway, Dallas, Texas, 75247, or contribute online at www.jesuscalls.com. If you want to know more about Jesus Calls International, visit our website, jesuscalls.com. Click and surf through the various sections for children, youth, and for women. You'll find the daily promise verses, messages of the Denikrans, ministry activities, up-and-coming events, and much more. You can also find all our products in the Resources Center. Visit JesusCalls.com, click, and get into God's presence. Watch Jesus Calls with Dr. Paul Denegren the same time next week. Until then, may the Lord be with you. Amen.